haul. It is my second installment of my Halloween hauls going on. This one's kind of slim compared to what I've got. It's going to come next week. So if you are not already subscribed and you are interested in seeing that video, go ahead and click that subscribe button down below. Don't forget. And um, yeah, if you are interested at all in seeing what I got this week, just go ahead and keep on watching. So first things first, I'm just going to get the one item out of the way that is not Ray Dunn, um, but it is going to be used in my Ray, door. Ray Dunn Halloween decor. I'm so excited. I am stuttering over my damn words. But it's <clears throat> it might not be everyone's cup of tea, but I thought it was kind of cool. It's just like a marble um, skull. So I thought this would be kind of cool to display with the Ray Dunn, um, just because I don't want everything to be Ray Dunn, so I'm trying to get some pieces that I think will look really nice with it. So I got this little guy because I don't have a skeleton head. I don't really have much Halloween decor, shockingly enough. But yeah, I did get this guy. I got him from Home Goods, and he was $7.99 if you are interested. And then we're just going to get into the Ray Dunn portion. I'm going to get the non-Halloween stuff out of the way first. And then I'm going to do Halloween and fall. Um, like I said in the beginning, it's not a lot of Halloween this week. Next week is is another freaking story. It's Next week is going to be absolutely huge, but I kind of wanted to keep it the way that I purchased it rather than just doing it all at once because that would just, it would take too long to film for me personally. I wouldn't have enough room around me to haul it all in one video. I know. Whatever. So the first thing that I'm seeing right now, I'm just going to pick it up and it is the sweets canister. I've been looking for this thing for freaking ever and I'm so happy that I got it. It was $12.95, $12.99 um, $12 and it was from TJ. Um, so excited to get my hands on this. Finally, I've just been waiting for it to recirculate. The next thing I want to show you is something that I'm kind of regretting, but I'm honestly probably just going to keep it anyways, and it is the black whisk. I do have the one that said, the white one that says mix, so that's why I kind of want to keep it because it says whisk. Did I say the white one that says whisk, or is it the white one that says mix? My brain is mashed potatoes. Um, but yeah, I got this one. I think I am going to keep it. The individual utensils are insanely expensive, like stupid expensive, $14.99. It's a stainless steel. I guess that's what causes it to be so much. The next thing I'm going to show you guys is the ice cream scoop. That says scoop. I didn't get the one that says ice cream, even though I do kind of want the one that says ice cream, but I'm not picky. This one was also $14.99, and I actually just saw, I think, on one of the Ray Dunn pages that somebody, somebody's husband actually used this to scoop out ice cream and it broke. So... I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to be actually using it to scoop out ice cream. I think I'd be too nervous. And this is way too expensive to have break. So I did get this. If it's not going to be used, it's going to be for display because the second to last item that I got that is not Halloween is the jewelry box. And oop, it's got the receipt in there. Um, and it has the little dividers in there. I did want to get something for like my rings, my Amazon rings, um, they are my Amazon favorites video, and if you have not seen that, I will link it above. Um, and I just have a lot of like miscellaneous rings and small little statement pieces, so I wanted something to put them in, and I didn't want them to be all in the favorites things because it doesn't have any sort of divider. So I wanted a new one that had all the dividers, so I did get the one that says jewelry, so I got this. Okay, and the last non-Halloween item is this guy. I was trying to hold out not getting it yet, um, just because it's kind of expensive, but it's fine. Um, but I just don't have a purpose for it right now, but I will. That's the thing, and who knows by the time I need it, if it'll even be circulating for me to get. So it is the spoon fork knife little guy. Um, this is 29, oh, 29, this is 19.99. Um, that's why it's a little bit more expensive, but um, I did want this for the new house that is still in the process of being built. And I'm so excited. We got we got concrete, guys. We got concrete. Um, but yeah, I wanted to get that for when we do kind of host gatherings. We can put out plastic silverware 
and we can use that to put it up. So I got that. So now on to the Halloween stuff. Uh, like I said, this isn't a lot, but that's what we're here for. Um, the first thing that I got is the orange. I can't talk today. Do you guys hear me? Is the orange trick loaf dish. I like this. Um, it was $12.99, but I just saw somebody call like the baby boo. The baby boo is so freaking adorable. But I wanted my next, the next best thing, which is the trick. So I did get this. Um, obviously, I don't plan on baking anything because I'm a terrible baker, but it's going to be for display. And the next thing that I got is the black double sided Happy Halloween with the orange interior. Um, yeah. Not much to say on this. It's pretty basic. This one isn't Halloween, but it is fall, and it is the Gobble Mug. It does not have the orange interior. I kind of wish I could find the orange interior one, but I'm not picky. I got it. it says Gobble, and I'm going to drink it when I gobble till I wobble. Okay? Okay, guys. I'm sorry. I didn't realize when I planned this that this, this one isn't going to be as exciting. The last thing that I got is the mug set that says Toxic Witch, and I'm so excited. I'm just going to go ahead and tell you right now. The only thing that I bought this weekend, I'm filming on Sunday. The only thing that I bought this weekend was the Witch Teapot. I don't know if you guys have seen it. I'll insert a picture. And it has, like, the witch's leg sticking out of it. And I saw actually somebody repurpose the top and put it in the witch mug. So I think that's kind of what I'm going to do for display purposes. But yeah, um, this, this one's kind of lame, but still kind of exciting, at least for me, because there are pieces that I don't have. So, okay, that's going to be it for today's video. I know the haul wasn't as big, at least the Halloween portion wasn't as big as I kind of anticipated. I guess just when I was splitting all my stuff up for each week, this week, I didn't get as much. And that's going to be it for today's video. Like I said in the beginning of this video, don't forget to subscribe. Turn on that post notification bell so you are notified of my haul next week. You will not be disappointed. I mean, I'm not going to have any canisters. I'm going to I'm gonna straight up and tell you that right now. But I got some pretty cool stuff. So, I would love it if you just subscribe, become part of our family, and yeah. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, and I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys. Oh, 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 oh,